A father digs desperately but carefully through the rubble. Any wrong move could be fatal. <laughs> Suddenly, a sound emerges from the dark, the muffled cries of little Noor. <laughs> Noor, whose name means light in Arabic, is now safe and sound. For many, there is no miracle rescue. In the city of Samada, emergency services extract the lifeless bodies of two young boys from the rubble, two brothers found holding on to one another. Across the border in Turkey, the search for survivors is just as frantic. In this town, there are no rescue workers, just civilians looking for any sign of life. In some parts of the country, snowfall has completely covered the ruins. The ground is frozen and there is no rescue operation in progress. I have two nephews in the wreckage behind me. Thousands are currently under the rubble. The authorities won't let us save them by our means, but they don't send anyone to help either. President Erdogan has responded to these cries for help, promising that aid is coming. We have received offers of assistance from 70 different countries and 14 international organizations. The president has also pledged 100 billion liras, equivalent to around 5 billion euros in financial help, 